Supersize your business with no nonsense November. Tip and tool number three. Sharon Hornelstrom here. And today and every day this month of November, just like hunters have no shave November and sometimes they're significant others <laughs> because they're off hunting, uh, we are going to share a lesson learned, a tip, a strategy, a tool, and a tool that can support incorporating that strategy into your everyday life and business to help you to avoid some of the challenges and the problems that I and the people that I work with have had growing and building and supersizing our businesses. So today's is, our tip is to practice mindfulness daily. And I'm going to share my favorite tool with you. It's an app from Victoria Gallagher. She is a famous hypnotist and law of attraction uh, proponent, I guess, law of attraction hypnotist. But she covers any topic, any problem, any challenge you can possibly imagine. In her app called Believe, which she launched a little under a year ago. I'm on day 257 today. I practice what I preach. I practice mindfulness daily. And I use her app to help me do that. I've got a handful of other apps on my phone. Uh, Headspace, uh, Access Consciousness. I can't think of the others. But I kind of stopped using them once I started using Victoria's Belief app because it's got hypnosis sessions, it's got trainings and courses, it's got uh, it's got thousands of recordings on it, and she's adding new ones all the time. It's got meditations and affirmations, so it's got a plethora of tools that you can use, plus a timer for just meditating or a timer for bringing yourself back in. It's got the ability to set reminders on it. So for uh, example, on mine, I have reminders set at different times of day with a phrase on them that reminds me to think about the certain thing that I want to remind myself about during the day, if that makes sense. So it's a really flexible tool. Uh, I'll share my stats in the comments below from today because I think I'm sort of a super user of the tool. I use it to help me with the Let's Grow Annual Challenge because it's something we do daily and by doing meditation, being mindful, and hypnosis and affirmations, those are all things that we can do daily and we can incorporate into other areas and aspects of our business and our life. Uh, of course, we do these things as an individual, but we can also model them for the people in our organization because when they see that we're pulling ourselves into the present moment and being present in conversations and meetings and in different situations and how we handle them, uh, then they're going to want to know what you're doing and you can share it with them. That's why I share believe with people because I believe in it, right? I love the, I love the name of it as well. Uh, and uh, been following Victoria since her previous app, which was called Hip Talk. And there were, I think, over 500 hypnosis and uh, meditations and affirmations on that app as well. And now she's more than doubled that in the new app. And there's great graphics and there's all kinds of features that I don't use. You can create your own playlists eventually. I don't use that because I, I will eventually because I like to listen to uh, hypnosis when I go to bed each night. I get up in the morning. I listen to a meditation or an affirmation. I listen to affirmations during the day because I can listen to them while I'm doing other things. So I just keep my mind present and focused on the things that I want every single day and having tools that can do that nowadays with cell phones and technology, it's so much easier than it used to be. So do you practice mindfulness daily? Have you got a tool that you use for that or just have you built it into your everyday activity? I have, I have secret ways of doing uh, and reminding myself to be mindful that I'm not going to share unless somebody asks me when I want, because they're kind of embarrassing, but they're things that I do as part of my daily routine. I guess I've shared that I do affirmations when I brush my teeth. So every morning and every night I do affirmations and I've been doing them for a long time because they support my long-term goals and objectives personally and professionally. Uh, but it's just a way to make sure that I always do it and I don't forget because I've linked it to something that I'm already in the habit of doing. And that's one of my secret ways of doing things daily and making sure they actually happen is by incorporating them into the ordinary moments of my life. And we can do that with our businesses as well, for sure. That's why we use systems and processes. All right. Any questions? Share in the comments below how you use mindfulness and how often you practice it so we can learn from one another. Have a great day. I'll of course, be with you tomorrow with tip number four and tool number four for our no-nonsense November to supersize and grow your business. Have a great day.